wait a minute. Okay, I'm going crazy with this shit. NASA releases the Big Felix von Gardner Edge of Space Jump. While Neil deGrasse Tyson was saying, the world's up here, and oblate spheroid. But NASA shows perfect spheres. Now, true skeptics have found some things that question the edge of space jump, and a lot of people have taken notice. So now, many years later, Neil comes out with and states outright the camera lenses were curved, giving false images. I mean, comes right out and says it quickly before making jokes and totally being funny. Now it's a big actual joke. It's a joke that the whole publicity stunt, or whatever you want to call it, literally deceived and tricked everyone into seeing curves that don't exist. It's a big joke from the edge of space. The world is flat and goes on joking with that stuff is flat. Totally mocking each and every person who could actually still believe in him at this point in time. I mean, wasn't that the whole point of the whole thing? What it was all about? Showing people the curve of the earth? And that's forgetting about all the other evidences showing inconsistencies uh, with logo placement and different photos proving it was staged. Uh, you, you gotta see it for yourself. And speaking about inconsistencies, inconsistencies, Neil hasn't been to space, yet he talks like he's been floating around the ISS every other weekend. Neil also, Neil also talks about everything he doesn't know about like a pro. That's because he's an actor. An actor who works for NASA. And, which explains why he's in movies. Hey, funny fact, if you research if you research Neil's education, you'll find out he bullshitted his way through college. That means he's a good actor who is selling out humanity for the money, power, and fame. I was going to say pussy, but he keeps on getting in trouble for that one. Seriously, Neil is a scumbag who'd sell out his own nana for the right money. Forget about the rest of humanity. He already sold us all for peanuts. I mean, of late... Oblate, spheroid, and pear are not even the same shape, and Neil used them both in the same sentence describing Earth. And now, that stuff is flat? That stuff is flat? That stuff is flat? He's never consistent. It's the same when uh, he, was, he was explaining gravity a couple years ago, a few years, whatever, how many years ago. First he said, I don't know. Next question. Ha, ha, ha. And then started the bullshit lie. He just started making shit up. Check out some of uh, Neil's great feels and see what I mean. Research it. Alright, until next time, please like, subscribe. God bless you.